Jordan skinny syrups and this is by far my favorite like oh this is so good I don't really care for this one I don't know why I like pumpkin but that wasn't really my jam I know some people use the white chocolate um pumpkin spice sugar new pumpkin syrup sugar free um I really haven't learned how to use this <laughs> Because every time I use it, it doesn't taste good. So, TikTok or somebody lying. This is a white chocolate mocha one, which is decent. And I'm, I'm in between today since I have toffee almond. Almond milk. Real quick. I forgot my mom bought me this, y'all. It's a um, plant-based protein. I don't know. It sounds good, but not today. We won't be trying it. Let me get a splash of almond. Since I usually don't use this one because my daughter drinks this almond milk. This is what she drinks. But sometimes I use it for my coffee. I'm just going to get my little... This is really what I use for my cold so I'm not even going to flex for y'all. This is me for this morning. Okay, I'm so I'm back. I just had to wait until I got on the main road. Um but yeah, so I'm going to go drop off my daughter's shoes. At this point, though, it's like lunchtime. They probably like, they called me this morning. But yeah, they called me early this morning. And I'm just like, listen, it's early. I'm not about to do this with y'all. It's lunchtime. So they probably figured that I wasn't coming. But if they think I'm working, then it makes sense why I'm coming at lunchtime. I mean, she had on booties, but they said she kept falling in them or something because she had on it has a little block heel but y'all y'all know the little kid booties it's really not a heel there i just anyways but she's with us she walks fine and then it's just probably because she's running and my baby is hitching toed <laughs> like her daddy so it's kind of like yeah she be falling because she pigeon -toed. But we really enjoyed being home for the little bit that we were. Um, enjoyed seeing family. Damn, and like, I need to get a camera. I need a, um, whatchamacallit, a smaller camera so like I can vlog. But I just haven't been able to afford that right now. Which, if you wait for me, you can afford it. <laughs> Like, I was about to say something stupid. No, you should wait till you can afford it. Do not charge things, you guys. It's bad. Speaking of charging things and credit, I really want to work on paying down debt, paying down credit cards and things like that. Um, because I know that it can build up and then, you know, life can hit. And then before you know it, you're really really over your head so for me i just really want to um pay down my debt yeah sorry the country is coming out it's not gonna be 
city city but it's gonna be decent right I was on the plane oh, leaving my husband from tech school I was sitting beside another service member someone who this this woman has been in service for years I don't know her technical rank and all of that all I know is I told her where I was going and she happened to be which is crazy someone who visits this area a lot because she does like the auditing and stuff for a certain I'm not gonna go into details about her job let's just say she was very familiar with the area in the base and her first comment was like oh I'm so sorry she said I'm so sorry she was like there's Waffle House there's a lot of places to eat but there's nothing there like she's like when I get there I can't wait to leave like I drive through and I'll be ready if she's ready to go so I thought nothing of it I'm just like okay whatever like okay it's probably not that bad I'm from South Carolina I'm from a little town I get it Y'all, there is a food place everywhere you look. When they build stuff, it's a food place, more than likely. Why? I am full transparency about 30 pounds or 30 to 35 pounds heavier than I've ever been in my life. Some of that I gained before I came here. But the bulk of it, I gained here. And because of pregnancy as well. And I'm not close to city. Uh, one of the selling points is, oh, you're close to Atlanta. Baby. Atlanta is not close. Atlanta is hours away. I won't say how many hours. But let's say hours. And it's not a hop and a skip. And you gotta go through traffic. Where I used to live, I could just go to Charlotte, like 20 minutes. If I wanna go to like Concord, it's like maybe 30 minutes. Hunters feel all that different, you know. So many things to do. The popping for the young black professional, popping for the young professional in general, Charlotte is popping, okay? Just like Atlanta. But here, no, career killer. Um, the number one employer on in this area is the base. But you're competing against veterans who may have retired here because a lot of people like to retire in this area. No surprise at all. So you're competing against them. You're competing against their family. You're competing against the demographic that is more dominant here. If you get where I'm going, then you follow you're competing against all of that baby experience holds more weight and word of mouth and who you know and unfortunately i've networked my butt off since i've been here and it's been hard like it's it's year two i've been here for two years and i just landed a job on base and it's I gotta get it. I'm about to go on base, so I have to. Okay, y'all. So it's night time. I'll finish bedtime and all that. <sighs> um.
Outside, we gather around the fireplace, and no one cares about yesterday.